I'm showing you how to download BeamMP for BeamMG Drive 0.33, and it's pretty simple. So all I want to do is go over to their official website, BeamMP.com. This is going to be linked down in the description below. Here you want to click on this green button, which will allow you to download the client. Clicking on this will start the download automatically. So now as you can see in my downloads, I have the BeamMP installer. I can simply double click on this, that's going to bring me to this location, and then you want to open up the BeamMP installer.exe. You can then choose your language, accept the agreement, and create a desktop shortcut if you want to do so. Then you can go to next once again, click on install, as you can see, it'll happen pretty fast. I can now just click on finish and it's done. What you have in your downloads here is simply the installer, so if you want to delete this, you can. Now if you have a desktop icon, you can simply launch BeamMG, BeamMP through that button. If you don't have it, you can of course also look for BeamMP right over here and it should pop up. I can simply double click on this and that is going to open it up as you can see. It'll first open up this black area, but then it'll automatically open up the BeamMG Drive launcher that we all know. Then you can launch BeamMG Drive as you usually would. Make sure, however, that you don't close this black window. So here I am in BeamMG Drive. If you launch it, just as I showed you how to do, then you should have this multiplayer button right here, which you can simply click on, and you'll be brought to this area where you can find all of these servers. You can favorite them, you can sort through this area down here as well. Um, apparently my Wi-Fi connection isn't great because they're not loading. Look at that, here they are. If the multiplayer button isn't working for you, or it's gray, just like the career mode one, then you want to go into your mod repository, then into the mods manager, and then you want to search here for BeamMP. As you can see, it'll show up as a mod over here. Basically, you want to make sure that the orange icon looks like this, and not like this. For some reason, it may have been deactivated. Um, sometimes it deactivates itself. If that's the case, simply click on this button. It'll be activated. You can go back and access multiplayer. If that still doesn't work, make sure it's active, restart your game, and then it should. Anyways, for right now, though, basically, that was that. If you have any questions, feel free to leave those down in the comments below. But for right now, thank you ever so much for watching, and I do, of course, hope to see you again in the next one. Bye-bye.